Let us now learn how to make a fading platform in Roblox. And a typical place for a fading platform would be inside an Arby. So let's start with an Arby template. So here is my Arby. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to select these blocks over here. So I'm just going to select the blocks, press control, hold down the control and select all these blocks. Probably maybe except for the middle one here. So I'm going to select these four blocks and press delete. They're gone. I'm going to resize this block in the middle here. Let's give it some color. So not everything is going to be gray. How about blue? All right, so that's going to be our fading platform. So I'm going to go and rename this part now to fading platform. And we're going to click on the plus sign and add a script. Inside your script, just enter the following lines. Here we're declaring the platform and we added a touch event to that platform. So we're listening for when that platform is being touched. When the platform is being touched, it's going to connect to this function. First thing we're going to do, we're going to turn off the can touch. This is our debouncing process. And here we're using a for loop to change the transparency of our part. So we're going to make our part fade away slowly. We're going to start with I. So I is zero. But as it goes through the loop, it's going to keep changing the transparency. So the next time it goes through, it's going to add 0.1 to I. So I is going to become 0.1. And then it's going to become 0 0.2, 0 0.3. Eventually, I is going to become 1. And that's when it's going to be completely transparent. It's going to disappear. Here we have a task weight to slow down the loop. And once our part has completely disappeared, that's when I is 1. We're going to turn off the can collide. So now, if the player is still standing on the platform, the player is going to fall right through because can collide is off on the part. This here is going to make the part disappear for two seconds, and then it's going to reappear. We're going to set everything back to the way it was before. Transparency equals zero. Can collide is back to true, and can touch is back to true. So now another player or the same player can touch the part again to make it fade away. Let's play test and take a look. Okay. so. The blue platform is our fading platform. I'm going to make my way over there. Hopefully, I won't die before I reach there. All right, I'm at the checkpoint, so that's good. And here we go. I'm going to hop on it and stand on it. Oh, you see that? It faded away, and I fell right through. I'm going to try again. This time, I'm going to try and get off the platform before it fades away. Ready? Here we go. Let's hope I can make it. I made it. Woohoo! And guys, that's how you make a fading platform inside your Roblox Arby or inside any Roblox game.